because company values will trickle down and trickle up to our partners, to our clients, and to the rest of the companies, to our employees and on an individual basis. Every company has a different set of values. And while they're all respectable and they might be ingrained and embedded into the DNA of the company, this is what will give us a North Compass. When we hesitate, when we have very difficult decisions to make, you know, strategic decisions or operational decisions, going back to what's most important for the company as a whole will help us carve the journey and the trajectory for teams and for individuals. So for me, values set the tone and create the culture and they are the most important thing in an organization. I think like any personal relationship, like friendship, if your values aren't aligned, then it's not going to be a good fit. And I think we often think that certain values, you know, such as honesty or transparency or, or even doing the right thing or the norms in every company, but that's not the case. So I definitely think if you're looking for your next role, like clearly identifying your values and the values of any company you were thinking of agreeing to work for is definitely a worthwhile exercise. Company values equals company culture. And having a shared set of uh, values means that we have a shared set of goals and an understanding of how we're expected to work. And this creates an environment where people can do their best work. Um, I think these days, uh, most people don't just want to have a career and get paid. A lot of people are looking for meaning through work, um, you know, based on what they're doing. Are they achieving a bigger goal or, you know, the relationships that they're able to form in the workplace and, and values help define um, what you are trying to achieve better um, and, and kind of synthesize it to something that's a bit more meaningful. And also, I think, you know, based on the companies I've been at, um, the ones that have really strong values and a very strong cultures. And, and those are the kind of places that inspire a lot of loyalty and a sense of belonging. And I think that's, that's something that we're all looking for, um, you know, from work these days. Um, so I'm a huge, huge believer in living by and celebrating our values. In fact, um, last month we had a huge wide company wide event in Dublin. Everyone flew in from everywhere. And I like set out a, a morning just to talk about our values, why they're important and, and sort of giving out awards for people that have really exemplified, um, living those values, you know, values are things that unite us. They make us part of something that's, that are, that's bigger than ourselves. And, you know, they're deeply ingrained into how we operate, how we hold ourselves accountable and, and how we aspire to be. And what I love is that when I go into a flip dish office or when I meet another flip disher, there's this instant connection. And I think a lot of that has to do with the fact that we hire people that are aligned to our values and, and we all sort of feel that those values are important to us. Um, and so I think, you know, what are the five beliefs and values that Flip Dish live by? You know, the first is that there are no speed limits on the road to success, otherwise known as our urgency value. Um, we also believe that if you shoot for the stars, you'll probably land on the moon, which is our ambition value. Um, we believe that it pays to be hot, honest, open and transparent. Um, we believe you're the average of the five people that you spend the most time with, which is also known as our high performance value. Um, and we also follow a value of flip dish, flip dish first, which is essentially around treating everyone like an adult.